The following video showcases the views and opinions of young adults from the age group of 9 to 18 years. This is an attempt to get students to speak about issues that are close to their heart. Watch and get a glimpse of what the future of India is thinking and where is India's youth headed. Viewers are requested to consider the student's age before judging and voting. It was just a few days ago that we decided to change the flooring of our room. And my father casually asked me, Tum chi room kiti square foot chye go? And I was like, just dumb for a second. I never experienced such a situation before. But let me tell you something. I had been solving equations about square foot since fifth standard. But what were its practical implications, I didn't know. So, this is what our education system lacks. We are told to munch our fingers and remember them for a lifetime. But does it help? We are not taught how to make practical life decisions. Yes, friends, you heard it right. I am Sharvari Kulkarni here to express my views about the educational system in India. Of course, our educational system is one of the best systems in the world. But as you all know, nothing is 100% accurate. And our system too has some loopholes. Let me share with you an example. I mug up answers, I get good marks and finally I get a good job and thanks to my mugging. But what if I grow up and get a fake call from a fake bank asking about my credit card details? I will surely enough without thinking give them all the information. So what is the use of me throughout these years while I am learning and simply I cannot distinguish between a fake call and an original one? So what can be done? We can take small steps. There must be a school, uh, there must be a su subject in school where we will be taught about how to fill a check, how to do internet banking and structure of our insurance policies and most importantly, we must know to invest our money in the right way. Keeping in mind that we must also be aware of such fa fake phone calls. Uh, let us consider two men. One man is educated and the other one, well, you can say not that educated. But the second one knows to invest his money in the proper way. So actually, he is the one who is going to be more successful in terms of saving his money. Uh, actually, even uh, at the starting, even I was little reluctant to uh, uh, learn about internet banking as I thought that it won't get me more good marks but then I thought that I'm going to be the one who is going to be more advantageous in future I'm going to be well versed in such financial things so why to start learning everything at such a young age do you remember that twinkle twinkle little star poem from your nursery of course you all might know Whatever we uh, learn during our childhood, we remember it more clearly than anything else. To conclude, I would like to say that our education system has faced many ups and downs, but at the same time it has produced many jewels for raising the flag of our country. There is still an open window to, for us to improvise our education system. I hope that somewhere in our talk you do realize that uh, it is important to be educated but it is equally important to be street smart. Thank you. Don't forget to like and subscribe.